虚的，所有虚的。Welcome back, guys, to Eight Six Thieves, and today I'm bringing you a throwback video. Um, when it comes to K-pop, SNSD is like my favorite group, and I have like a bunch of other groups that are my favorite. And really, lately, SNSD hasn't been putting out too much. Everybody's been doing their own solo stuff, like Seo Yun and Tian is doing her solo stuff all the time. So there's really not too much of the old, like the group, back together. I think um, the album earlier, uh, I think 2016 or end of 2015. But uh, yeah, right now there really isn't too much material for me to react to when it comes to SSD. That's why I've been reacting to a lot of other K-pop artists. Like I re reacted to Psy, I reacted to Twice, I reacted to a couple of other videos, compilation videos. But uh, I know there's a lot of K-pop fans, and on the Facebook pages, me and my cousin, who are admins of, are there's a lot of K-pop fans. So I think what I'm gonna do is at least once or twice a week, I'm gonna just throw it back and react to some of the older K-pop videos if there's nothing to react to, or react to any of the new releases of K-pop because. Uh, I enjoy K-pop music in general. I listen to all types of music, mostly like Western, and if there's some catchy K-pop songs, I'll listen to it. But uh, you can't deny the power of K-pop. So today, the reaction video that I decided to look at is an old video. A lot of K-pop groups and artists they practice a lot. A lot of them are trainees, and they practice and especially choreography. They have to be like amazing at dancing as well, singing and acting, like being a model, like triple threat or quadruple threat. So they have practice rooms in their companies. And one of the rooms that we see a lot is the SM Town practice room that we always see, like SSD practice in, Super Junior before, Shiny, and in the newer groups and stuff like that practice in there. And I used to always love that because you could just see them not all dolled up, just the regular chill clothes, casual clothes, sweats, or just anything comfortable to them. And you just see it's it's fun because you can see them having fun at the same time. As fans, we get to see this, I don't know, behind the scenes kind of look at it. Um, I know there's some behind the scenes songs like for Mr. Mr. or Lionheart, but this one is one of my favorite like behind the scenes. It's SSD The Boys. And it's in the practice room. And of course, this timeline for SSD has Jessica in the group as well. And for those that don't know, Jessica already left. So SSD is only eight, which is sad to some, to most SSD fans. But uh, can't do all that now. We're gonna enjoy this video. And uh, hope you guys enjoy it too. We're gonna start this in three, two, one, go. GG That's my favorite part, this like musical section. Hey, Tiffany. Of course, you can have Taeyong. You know. Taeyong with the short hair. Love it. Sunny. Sunny is a... Uh, Jelly's favorite. That's so sick. Hey. 
I love this part right here. Oh yeah. That's so sick. Just like a... I know the choreography isn't like the hardest compared to other groups, but it's so sick. So catchy. Mm -hmm. It's just so catchy. Hey, hey, hey. So in sync together. In sync, this all sync together. from it like you just like it's like late in the morning here and it's like you just want to like I don't know you get like, your hopes get lifted definitely not a downer when you watch stuff like this it's really uh I don't know their music is just so catchy just it doesn't matter like if you can understand what they're saying or not it's just so catchy but uh I love it of course everyone's there like I said all nine of them you see them all with their different parts and singing you can see uh I don't know, this looks fun. And uh wait. There's also uh, Mr. Taxi, Lionheart. Oh there's quite a few dance practices, but uh we'll save those vid those reactions for later. But uh one thing that I really remember when I watched this is uh they did a reality show called Dangerous Boys where they have a bunch of adolescent like guys who are in like junior high and high school and they're like bad kids or whatever and they skip school they don't listen they get into fights and uh obviously these boys are fans of snsd or not even fans but snsd are really pretty girls so it, it they have an effect on them or yeah to a certain extent they have an effect on them and they try to like tutor him tutor the young guys and mentor them to, I don't know, get them on the right path. And at the same time, they teach them how to do the the boys dance, which is hilarious because it's a, it's a girl's dance, right? But guys can kill it too. So uh, that's what I remember when I watched this. But uh, yeah, you should check it out. I think Dangerous Boys is probably, if you just Google just Dangerous Boy English Club, yeah, you'll probably find it somewhere. Everybody, it's everywhere now, but uh, yeah. That's my uh, throwback reaction to SNSD The Boys practice version in the practice room. Um, uh, I think that's it. I hope you guys like this reaction. If you liked it, leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about it. Is this the? Is this one of your favorite uh, performances when it comes to just 
behind the scenes practice or do you have a video in mind that you want me to watch just let me know and I'll get back to you I'll re probably reply because I don't have too many comments and uh, I'll get around to reacting to that video that you let me know um, I think that's pretty much it um, don't forget to subscribe I'm trying to get to 100 subscribers hope you guys have a good day and remember thanks skinny kids peace